Hi, scholars. Welcome to another video. I have a surprise guest. Frankie. <laughs> this is Frankie. Remember I showed you him skateboarding? He's getting shy. Anyways, if you hear any snorting, that's him. He sounds like a pig. Can you hear him? He's there it is. He's getting nervous. Anyways, today we're going to do our letters of the week. We have two letters of the week in this video. Plus, we have two new sight words this week, okay? All right. Here is our first letter. We're going to go into the video, and I'm going to put Frankie down, okay? All right. Here's our first letter video. X. X. Crissy Crossy makes an X. Crissy Crossy makes an X. Kissy, 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 crossy makes an X. Crissy Crossy makes an X. Crissy Crossy makes an X. Kissy, 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 crossy makes an X. All right, Chrissy Crossy makes an X, right? Okay, so this is our first letter of the week. Here is our letter card for X. We, If we look, you see big X over here and little X over here. We call big X uppercase X, right? And little X is lowercase X. They look the same, uppercase and lowercase X. But if you look over here, we can tell they're different sizes, right? Good. Let's go ahead and look on our letter card at the picture. Down here is a picture of an x-ray. An x-ray is a special camera that can take a picture through your skin to look at your bones. So if you ever hurt your fingers one day or if you ever hurt a bone one day, um, they take a special picture to see what happened, to see if you broke a bone and maybe you need a cast. Um, so it's really cool and that special camera is called an x-ray. X-ray, we know, makes the sound what? X, 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 X. It's not S, it's not Z, but it almost makes a K sound or a C sound. It's X, X, X. Can you try? X, X, X. Very good. All right. Let's see how to correctly write our letter X. We've already learned about this at the beginning of the school year, so this is just a review. Let's look at uppercase X first. Starting point for uppercase X needs to start at the top. You cannot start at the bottom. You have to start at the top. First thing is we make a diagonal all the way down to the floor. Do you see how it touches the bottom? Then you need to lift your pencil up. Go back up to the top and crissy crossy, right? Diagonal down to the floor. So starting point at the top, diagonal to the floor, pick up your pencil, go back up, diagonal crisscross to the floor. Good, let me try one more. Diagonal to the floor. Take my pencil up, diagonal to the floor. What's wrong with that one? Oh, I didn't start at the top over here. So you have to make sure you start at the top again, okay? Because uppercase has to touch the top and the bottom. All right, good job. Okay, now let's go ahead and let's look at lowercase. Let's look at lowercase x. Lowercase x starts, lowercase x starts where? At the top or in the middle? On the middle, right? The tummy line, the dotted line. So, same thing as big X, it goes to a diagonal to the floor. So starting in the middle, diagonal to the floor, 
go back to the middle. Don't go all the way to the top on this one. Go to the middle, the dotted line, and crissy crossy diagonal to the floor. Okay? So let's try. So if I'm making little x, lowercase x, should I start at the top? No, right? We need to start here on the middle dotted line like this one does. Diagonal to the floor. Now what? Go to the top. Oh, okay. Go start back at the middle and crissy crossy diagonal down. Okay? All right. I want you to watch this one. Tell me if it's right. Sure, it looks the same, but I accidentally started down here. Remember, I don't like when you start at the at the bottom because the correct way to make your X is to start from the top, right? Crissy crossy down, then start at the top in the dotted line and crissy crossy diagonal down to the floor. Okay, very good. All right, let's see. Let's see what song we have. So here we go. I'm going to sing and then you can sing too, okay? I'll sing first. Here is X, here is X, X says X, X says X. X is in box, X is in fox, X, 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 X. All right, are you ready to sing? Let's try. This is a sight word and this is a sight word, so you should know those. Ready? Here is X. Here is X. X says X. X says X. X is in box. X is in fox. Very good. If you want to try it by yourself, you can go ahead and pause the video and you can sing it again by yourself. Good job. All right, moving on. Let's say the sound. Ready? X. 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 Box. Fox. Very good. Find the pictures with the x sound. So we're looking for pictures that have the x sound. It could be at the beginning or it could be at the end. Let's think about it. Box. Does that have the x sound in it? Box. Yes. Good job. What about rocket? Does rocket have the x sound? Rocket. No, that didn't work. What about fox? Does that have the x sound? Fox. Yes. What about queen? Does queen have the x sound? Queen. No. What about mix? Does mix have the x sound? Mix. Yes. What about yo-yo? Does yo-yo have the x sound? Yo-yo. No, that didn't work. All right. Okay, very good, boys and girls. You did excellent for our letter M. Now we're going to move on to our next letter this week. Did I say letter M? <laughs> I'm sorry, letter X, ah, sorry. You did very good with letter X. I was looking at the next slide. Letter X is one of our letters this week and our next letter is, do, 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 do. letter Z. Z. Golly, 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 golly,
Z. I liked that song. Did you like it? I hope so. All right, so we know that Z makes what sound? Z, 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 Z. That's why she was saying, zoom, golly, 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 zoom, golly, golly. Very good. All right, here is our letter card for letter Z. If you look, you see big Z and little Z. They look the same, right? But one Z is much bigger than the other. Big Z is called uppercase Z. And little C, Z is called lowercase Z. Very good. All right. On the Z card, I see a z, z, zebra. Z, z, zebra starts with the letter Z because Z makes the z, z, z sound. The z, z sound. Very good. All right. So we're going to draw our letter or write our letter Z correctly. With starting with um, big Z first or uppercase Z, our starting point needs to be on the top line, right? First thing we need to do is we're going to go to the side. We're gonna go this way, to your right, diagonal down, and go back over to your right, okay? I want you to notice the diagonal goes all the way to the bottom, and then it goes back to the right, yes? So starting point is on the top line. First thing I need to do is go to the side or the right, good. I need to go diagonal to the floor, not straight down, diagonal. Almost looks like the number seven. And then go back to the right. And I could have made this a little better. I should have stayed on the floor, but it's a little difficult on the computer. So I'll try to make this one better. Let's try one more time. Go to the right, diagonal down, and go to the right. That one's not right? Why? Oh, I didn't go all the way to the bottom. Remember, it has to go all the way to the bottom. So let me retry that one again. Go to the right, diagonal all the way down, go to the right. Good, that is big Z. Good, let's check out little Z. Little Z starts where? On the top line or on the dotted line? Little Z starts on the dotted line. It goes to the right, diagonal down, kind of like the number seven, and back to the right. Good, let me try. So starting point on the dots, go to the right, diagonal down, to the right. Okay, let me try again. Go to the right, down to the right. What's wrong with this one? I didn't diagonal. I went straight down, right? That doesn't look like a Z. That looks like, I don't know, a different shape, huh? Let's try again. I got to make sure I go to the right. I need to diagonal, right? I would go this way. Diagonal. Diagonal. I'm just playing. I can't figure it out on the camera. <laughs> Diagonal down and go to the right. Good. All right. So <clears throat> you have practice worksheets to practice this, and I will show you how to get there at the very end, okay? All right. I'm going to move on. And here is a song, another letter song. I'm going to read first, and then you can read with me. Here we go. <clears throat> Here is Z, here is Z, Z says Z, Z says Z is for zipper, Z is for zebra, Z, 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 Z. Okay, ready? You can sing with me. Here's your sight words. You know these words already. <clears throat> here we go. Here is Z, here is Z, Z says, Z says, Z is for zipper, Z is for zebra, Z, 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 
Z, z, z. All right. If you want to try again, go ahead and pause the video. Try it by yourself, okay? All right, I'm going to move on. Let's say the sound. Z. 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 Zebra. Z. Z. Zipper. Very good. Find the pictures that start with the Z sound. Oh, any, any pictures that have the Z sound. So it could have a Z in the middle. Well, let's figure it out. Hmm. Zebra. Let's try it out. Z. Z. Zebra. Does that have the Z sound? Yeah. That works. What about sun? Does s s sun have the z sound? No, careful, it sounds kind of the same. Sun starts with s. Zigzag. Does zigzag have the z sound? Z z zigzag. Yeah. Leaf. Does leaf have the z sound? Z, z, leaf. No, leaf starts with l, l. Octopus. Does octopus have the z sound? Let's try. Z, z, octopus. No, octopus starts with the letter o. Zipper. Does z, z, zipper start with the Z sound? Yes. Good job. Okay. So, oops. That was our letter Z. Now, what you can do is ask mom and dad to go to um, go to our Google Drive, and on Google Drive, Miss Paulina put up X and Z. Okay, these Q and V will be off by the time you see it. So X and Z is down here. If you click it, you have big X and little x, big Z and little Z. And you can work on these throughout the week. Okay, you have today, tomorrow, and Wednesday to try to finish these. Okay, all right, I'm going to quickly go through. We have two sight words this week. First sight word is... Two, like T the number two. W O. Two. Like the number. should be a review because we've already learned our number two, right? T-W-O is two. Now let's review this sight word. M-Y. My. Why? My. Okay, so the word my, you can use in different sentences, right? I can say, that is my friend. Or, that is my phone. This is my book. Right? Okay. Let's go ahead, we're gonna practice writing our words. First sight word, my, M-Y, my. I'm going to start with my M, making sure it touches the top and the bottom. I'm sorry, the middle line and the bottom. And then my Y, 
goes into the dirt. My, my why is kind of silly. I didn't mean to do it like that. <laughs> and two, like the number two, not like I go to the park, but I have two pens, two. I have two hands. I have two ears. I have two eyes. I have two eyebrows, two. Making sure my T goes from top to bottom. Cross is on that dotted line. My W is under the dots and my O takes up all the room under the dots, two. Very good. All right, that is it for our sight words and our letters. Thank you for watching the whole video. I know it was a kind of longer one. Don't forget, inside your Google Drive, it's on Class Dojo, Mom and Dad can get your X and Z worksheets. And you have today, tomorrow, and Wednesday to try to get your phonics letter worksheets done. These ones here. Okay? All right. I will see you in the next video. If you haven't checked it out, go watch the math video. And Frankie says bye. <laughs> okay. Miss you so much. Bye-bye.